planet Mercury enters Aquarius on February 20, 2024, and during this period, it will form conjunctions with Saturn and the Sun in Aquarius. This video focuses on the specific outcomes of Mercury's transit and the Aquarius sign. It's crucial to note that these interpretations are based on sidereal or Vedic astrology, which accounts for the approximately 24-degree difference with the tropical zodiac. Mercury embodies various attributes such as communication skills, marketing acumen, calculative ability, influence on younger siblings, hobbies, manual dexterity, intelligence, quick decision-making, logical thinking, and youthfulness. Aquarius, being the 11th sign of the zodiac, reflects the themes associated with the 11th house in astrology, such as achievements, aspirations, social networks, and group affiliations. Additionally, Aquarius embodies qualities like scientific inquiry, societal progress, and collective advancement, along with representing higher aspirations and rewards for all. Saturn governs Aquarius, though some perspectives also acknowledge Rahu's influence as a co-ruler of the sign. Mercury governs the signs of Gemini and Virgo. When positioned in Aquarius, Mercury finds itself in its own ninth house concerning its Gemini attributes and in its own sixth house concerning its Virgo characteristics. This placement fosters a strong inclination towards future-oriented thinking and visionary perspectives, alongside a readiness to adapt and fulfill roles as necessary. Mercury's presence in Aquarius expands its capacity for understanding beyond personal realms, particularly in comparison to its influence in Capricorn. Here, it perceives the interconnectedness of individual components within a broader framework, operating within a grander vision than in any other astrological sign. In times of uncertainty, the advice is to stop worrying and see how everything fits together in a bigger picture. During this period, there is likely to be a collective emphasis on intellectual pursuits, innovation, and humanitarian endeavors. This transit typically brings about a period marked by unconventional thinking, progressive ideas, and a strong desire for social change. For everyone, this transit suggests a time when communication, networking, and collaboration may flourish, particularly in fields related to technology, science, and social activism. People may feel more inclined to think outside the box, challenge traditional norms, and seek inventive solutions to problems. Individuals may find themselves drawn to group activities, community initiatives, or involvement in causes that promote equality, freedom, and humanitarianism. This transit encourages open-mindedness, tolerance, and a willingness to embrace diversity in perspectives. On a personal level, it's a favorable time for brainstorming new ideas, experimenting with different approaches, and expanding one's intellectual horizons. However, there may also be a tendency towards restlessness or unpredictability in communication and decision-making processes. Saturn and Sun presence can intensify the themes associated with the Aquarius sign. This period may make you focus on house significations where Aquarius lies in the birth chart. Saturn's influence brings a disciplined and structured approach to communication. Conversations may be more serious and focused on practical matters. It's crucial to recognize Mercury as a neutral planet that adopts the traits of planets it associates with. Thus, its impact during transits depends on its planetary alignments. In the absence of such connections, it reflects the nature of the ruling planet of the sign it's in. Mercury symbolizes communication influenced by surroundings, mirroring how conversations reflect one's company. In essence, Mercury's transit triggers curiosity regarding matters related to the house it traverses, prompting information gathering and sharing, aligning with Mercury's fundamental nature to communicate and exchange knowledge. To assess the impact of this transit, it's crucial to consider your ascendant and moon signs. The ascendant sign provides insights into the timing of life events, while the moon sign reveals how you'll emotionally respond to these changes. Additionally, consider the position of your current Mahadasha Lord in your birth chart, as it can shed light on how these transits will influence the recurring themes of your current Dasha period. A more precise understanding of the impact of this transit can be gained by examining Mercury's Ashtakavarga score in Aquarius. Keep in mind that the effects of this transit will differ from person to person, contingent on Mercury's interaction with the planets in their individual birth charts, or its transit through the zodiac. It's also worth noting that individuals currently experiencing the influence of Mercury Dasha may feel the effects of this transit more intensely. It's important to remember that the effects of this transit will vary for each person. To understand how this transit may affect you based on your zodiac sign and the houses it transits, let's delve into those specifics. For Aries, 
the transit of Mercury in Aquarius holds significant implications, particularly in areas concerning initiative, communication, and financial matters. Mercury governs the third house, associated with taking action, younger siblings, and short journeys, as well as the sixth house, which pertains to debt, health matters, and competition. As Mercury moves through Aquarius, it will influence the eleventh house, which represents income, gains, and social networks, presenting a progressive phase for Aries individuals. During this transit, Aries individuals are encouraged to engage actively with their friends, elder siblings, and wider social circles. Communication styles may shift from strictly professional to more relaxed and informal. Simultaneously, there's a heightened awareness regarding earnings and income, prompting individuals to assess their financial standing relative to their peers. This period encourages a strategic approach to financial matters, where individuals may seek to optimize their earnings and ensure they are on par with social standards. As the lord of the third house in the eleventh house, which is nine houses away, there may be increased communication and networking within your social circles. This could involve sharing ideas, making new connections, or engaging in group discussions related to your skills or interests. This period could encourage them to broaden their horizons and seek knowledge and skills beyond their immediate surroundings. In Aquarius, placed in its own sixth house away from Virgo, there's a willingness to adapt and serve in innovative ways. Aries individuals may find themselves actively engaged in activities that involve problem-solving, organization, or assisting others in unique ways. They may also seek out alternative approaches to improve their health and well-being. You might find that your work or health-related activities are influenced by your social interactions, or that you benefit from networking within your professional or health-related communities. For those who have invested prior effort and diligence in their professional pursuits, this transit brings favorable rewards. Aries individuals can anticipate positive developments in their careers, such as salary increases and advantageous incentives. Industries such as banking, professional services, and entrepreneurship are particularly highlighted, with the potential for significant progress and expansion. Success during this period is attributed to the adeptness in one's endeavors, persuasive communication skills, and the ability to seize opportunities effectively. On a personal level, Aries individuals can expect harmonious relationships with their spouses or partners. There's a sense of openness and honesty in expressing emotions, facilitated by strong communication channels. Bonds within familial and friendship circles are strengthened, contributing to a sense of overall prosperity and well-being. The transit suggests that by gradually refining one's personality traits and combining diligent effort with mental agility, Aries individuals can achieve significant progress and fulfillment across various aspects of life. In summary, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius indicates a period of growth and prosperity for Aries individuals, particularly in matters relating to income, career advancement, and interpersonal relationships. By leveraging their communication skills, strategic acumen, and diligent efforts, individuals can navigate this phase successfully, fostering positive outcomes both professionally and personally. For Taurus, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius holds significant implications, particularly concerning their family, finances, and professional pursuits. Mercury, governing their second house of family and finance, as well as their fifth house of love, children, and speculation, will journey through Aquarius in their tenth house of profession, career, and status, signaling a period ripe with potential progress and success. During this transit, Taurus individuals can anticipate a shift towards more serious and professional communications. Interactions may involve governmental agencies, legal matters, superiors such as bosses, or paternal figures, all of which carry weighty implications. There's a curiosity to understand governmental procedures or legal systems, indicating a desire for clarity and understanding in these areas. Additionally, discussions with superiors regarding career progression or appraisals are highlighted during this time. Since Mercury is in its own ninth house away from Gemini, Taurus individuals may adopt a forward-thinking approach to financial matters during this transit. They might be inclined towards long-term financial planning, investment strategies, or exploring innovative ways to generate income. This period favors expanding their financial horizons through education, travel, or ventures with a global perspective. In Aquarius, placed in its own sixth house away from Virgo, there's a blend of creative thinking and practical service-oriented activities. Taurus individuals may find fulfillment in utilizing their creative talents to contribute to projects or initiatives aimed at serving others or improving community welfare. With Mercury's influence in Aquarius enhancing their knowledge and self-assurance, Taurus individuals are poised to excel in their professional endeavors. 
Their dedication to collaboration and timely submission of work showcases their commitment to excellence. Creative ideas pertaining to business or employment are likely to yield fruitful financial gains, bolstering their financial stability and prosperity. Taurus individuals may excel in problem-solving within their professional lives during this transit. Their analytical skills, coupled with a willingness to explore unconventional solutions, can help them overcome obstacles or challenges in their career paths. They may find themselves taking on leadership roles or spearheading initiatives that require strategic thinking and creative problem-solving abilities. On the personal front, Taurus individuals can expect a harmonious atmosphere fueled by their focus and efforts. Relationships with their partners are characterized by gentleness and understanding, fostering a deep bond built on mutual respect and affection. Furthermore, strong familial connections contribute to a sense of stability and security, projecting a positive aura that elevates their social standing and status within their social circles. In summary, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius bodes well for Taurus individuals across various facets of their lives. By embracing opportunities for professional growth, fostering harmonious relationships, and maintaining a steadfast focus on their goals, they stand to reap rewards both in their career trajectory and personal fulfillment. The period ahead offers a conducive environment for Taurus individuals to thrive and prosper, supported by their inherent determination and resilience. For Gemini individuals, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius holds significant implications, particularly concerning their self-image, domestic life, and spiritual pursuits. With Mercury governing their ascendant, first house of self and personality, and their fourth house of domestic peace and prosperity, its journey through Aquarius in the ninth house of fortune, spirituality, and long journey signals a period ripe with potential for growth and exploration. During this transit, Gemini individuals are inclined towards seeking knowledge and understanding in areas related to religion, philosophy, and ancient texts. There's a desire to engage with spiritual mentors or gurus, indicating a quest for deeper meaning and enlightenment. Additionally, opportunities for long-distance travel and interactions with people from diverse backgrounds are likely, facilitating cultural exchange and broadening one's perspective. The acquisition of knowledge, particularly in educational matters, is highlighted during this period. Mercury in the ninth house can enhance your ability to articulate and communicate your beliefs, ideals, and philosophical viewpoints. You may feel compelled to engage in discussions or debates about matters of faith, ethics, or morality. Your communication style may become more expansive, open-minded, and tolerant of diverse perspectives. In Aquarius, placed in its own sixth house away from Virgo, Gemini individuals may need to find a balance between their home and professional lives. They may encounter conflicts related to their home or family that require their attention. Mercury, as the ruler of Virgo, represents analytical thinking and attention to detail. During this transit, you may find yourself engaged in conflicts or debates related to belief systems, ideologies, or philosophical viewpoints within your home. The alignment of Mercury in Aquarius suggests that Gemini individuals stand to benefit from the progressive outcomes within the professional realm. By leveraging their good fortune wisely, they can capitalize on professionally orchestrated efforts, yielding favorable results. Their business acumen and proactive initiatives are likely to garner recognition among colleagues, establishing them as reliable sources of professional counsel. Furthermore, the transit augurs well for long-distance business or professional travel, facilitating beneficial connections with foreign counterparts. This opens avenues for collaboration and expansion, bolstering their professional network and enhancing opportunities for growth and advancement. On the domestic front, Gemini individuals can expect the blessings of good fortune to manifest in increased prosperity and strengthen familial bonds. The availability of time allows for meaningful interactions with friends and family, fostering a sense of unity and camaraderie. Additionally, quality time spent with their partner nurtures strong relationships, while efforts to build a supportive bond with their father are likely to be fruitful. In summary, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius presents Gemini individuals with a myriad of opportunities for personal and professional growth. By embracing their curiosity, leveraging their skills, and fostering meaningful connections, they can navigate this period with confidence and optimism. The alignment of planets sets the stage for success, both in their endeavors and in nurturing fulfilling relationships, ultimately contributing to their overall well-being and happiness. For Cancer individuals, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius in the eighth house holds significance, particularly in terms of their initiative, familial relationships, and financial matters. With Mercury governing their third house of initiative, courage, and siblings, as well as their twelfth house of expenditure and loss, 
Its journey through Aquarius presents a mixed bag of opportunities and challenges, necessitating diligence and hard work for moderate progress. During this transit, Cancer individuals are drawn towards exploring occult sciences, mysticism, and secret matters. There's a deep-seated curiosity prompting research and investigation into hidden information, leading to communication and sharing of findings. Since Mercury is in its own ninth house away from Gemini, Cancer individuals may feel a strong urge to explore higher knowledge or philosophical insights during this transit. They may be drawn to subjects such as metaphysics, spirituality, or cultural studies that expand their understanding of the world. This period favors learning, engaging in meaningful conversations with people from diverse backgrounds. Cancer individuals may experience heightened intuitive abilities during this transit, allowing them to communicate with depth and sensitivity. Mercury's transit through the 8th house can prompt you to explore taboo or hidden subjects with a critical and analytical mindset. You may find yourself engaging in conversations or debates that delve into profound and intense subjects. Your communication style may become more probing and analytical as you seek to uncover hidden truths or understand complex issues on a deeper level. In Aquarius, Mercury transiting in its own sixth house away from Virgo, Cancer individuals may focus on financial planning and shared resources during this transit. They may engage in discussions or negotiations related to joint finances, investments, or inheritances. This period encourages them to take a pragmatic approach to managing their resources and collaborating with others for mutual benefit. Cancer individuals may approach challenges in their intimate relationships with a rational and analytical mindset. On the professional front, cancer individuals are urged to approach their endeavors with consideration and exert extra effort. While industries such as research, occult sciences, and insurance services may witness unexpected opportunities, capitalizing on them requires diligence and perseverance. The potential for future growth exists, but it hinges upon diligent work ethic and strategic planning. It's advised against making impulsive decisions regarding investments without careful consideration of available options. In interpersonal relationships, cancer individuals can anticipate positive responses from close friends and family members, fostering stronger bonds and improved communication. However, the pressure to meet perceived expectations should be balanced with self-care, as neglecting health may lead to unforeseen expenses. Striving for perfection in meeting others' expectations is discouraged, as authenticity and genuine care are paramount. In summary, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius presents cancer individuals with both challenges and opportunities across various facets of their lives. By embracing curiosity, exerting diligent effort in their professional pursuits, and nurturing meaningful relationships, they can navigate this period with resilience and optimism. Balancing practical considerations with emotional well-being is essential for maintaining stability and fostering personal growth amidst the flux of unexpected circumstances. For Leo individuals, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius holds significant implications, particularly concerning their family, partnerships, and professional endeavors. With Mercury governing their second house of family and finance, as well as their eleventh house of income and fulfillment of aspirations, its journey through Aquarius in the seventh house of partnerships, marriage, and associations indicates a period marked by good fortune and relationship dynamics. During this transit, Leo individuals are inclined towards communication with their spouses, partners, or individuals and relationships. The nature of these interactions is influenced by the characteristics of the zodiac sign involved, but the overarching theme revolves around engaging in dialogue with others. There's a heightened inclination towards business dealings and interactions with external parties, reflecting a focus on collaboration and interpersonal connections. Since Mercury is in its own ninth house away from Gemini, Leo individuals may approach their relationships with a future-oriented mindset during this transit. They may engage in meaningful conversations with their partners that explore ideas, long-term plans, or share dreams and aspirations. This period encourages them to communicate openly and creatively, fostering a deeper connection and mutual understanding in their relationships. In Aquarius, placed in its own sixth house away from Virgo, Leo individuals may excel in analytical problem-solving within their familial relationships during this transit. They may approach conflicts or challenges with a rational and logical mindset, seeking practical solutions that benefit both parties involved. This period favors open and honest communication that fosters trust, transparency, and mutual respect in their partnerships. Leo individuals may focus on financial planning and budgeting within their partnerships or joint ventures during this transit. They may engage in discussions or negotiations related to shared resources, investments, or financial responsibilities. 
This period encourages them to take a pragmatic approach to managing their finances and collaborating effectively with others for financial stability and growth. Professionally, Leo individuals are poised to experience positive outcomes fueled by their hard work, integrity, and reputation. Collaborative efforts with professional partners are particularly rewarding, as innovative ideas and fruitful collaborations contribute to career success. This period promises financial gains and recognition within their chosen field, bolstering their sense of fulfillment and accomplishment. On a personal level, Leo individuals can anticipate flourishing relationships characterized by love and strong bonds with their partners and family members. Quality time spent together fosters intimacy and closeness, while a robust social network provides opportunities for rejuvenating travel experiences. Despite potential distractions in relationships and increased expenses, Leo individuals are reassured that these are temporary challenges, and ultimately, everything will align for the best. In summary, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius offers Leo individuals a blend of opportunities and challenges across various spheres of life. By nurturing relationships, embracing collaborative endeavors, and maintaining a positive outlook, they can navigate this period with resilience and optimism. The promise of professional success, enriched personal connections, and supportive social networks set the stage for growth and fulfillment, even amidst transient obstacles. For Virgo individuals, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius holds crucial implications, particularly concerning their self-image, career pursuits, and overall well-being. With Mercury governing their ascendant, first house of self and personality, and their tenth house of career and profession, its journey through Aquarius in the sixth house of debt, illness, and rivals signals a period necessitating caution regarding health and professional competition. Mercury is exalted in Virgo and the sixth house has the same significations as Virgo, imbuing individuals with a heightened sense of calculation, perfectionism, and strategic communication. This period prompts Virgos to adopt a clever and cunning approach in dealing with obstacles, hurdles, and competitors, aiming to outmaneuver and overcome challenges. They may approach tasks with precision, attention to detail, and a systematic mindset, leading to increased efficiency and productivity. This period favors finding practical solutions to challenges or obstacles that arise in their work or personal lives. With Mercury, as the Ascendant Lord transiting the sixth house, Virgo individuals may focus on self-care and well-being through service-oriented activities. They may find fulfillment in helping others, whether through volunteer work, caregiving, or acts of kindness. This period encourages them to prioritize their health and wellness while also contributing to the welfare of those around them. During this transit, you may find yourself communicating extensively in your workplace or regarding work-related matters. This could involve discussions with colleagues, clients, or supervisors, as well as handling paperwork, emails, or other forms of correspondence related to your professional responsibilities. Amidst the demands of professional and personal life, Virgo individuals must prioritize their health and well-being. Stress and carelessness have the potential to exacerbate existing health issues, making it imperative to manage stress levels and adopt a proactive approach to self-care. This transit may involve discussions or consultations related to health matters, such as doctor's appointments, medical treatments, or wellness routines. You may also engage in conversations about diet, exercise, or lifestyle changes aimed at improving your overall well-being. Professionally, Virgo individuals are driven to pursue excellence in their business endeavors, leveraging strategic tactics to yield fruitful outcomes and garner recognition for their dedication. However, the intense focus on achieving goals may come at a cost to their health, leaving them feeling drained and fatigued. It's crucial to strike a balance between career ambitions and self-care to mitigate potential negative impacts on well-being. During this transit, it's advisable for Virgos to tread cautiously in challenging situations, as competitors may capitalize on vulnerabilities. Conflict resolution skills are essential in navigating personal relationships, as trivial issues may escalate into conflicts. Maintaining harmony and attention to detail are key to fostering healthy and fulfilling connections with loved ones. In summary, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius presents Virgo individuals with both challenges and opportunities across various aspects of their lives. By leveraging their analytical prowess, strategic acumen, and conflict resolution skills, they can navigate this period with resilience and adaptability. Prioritizing health, maintaining professional integrity, and nurturing harmonious relationships are essential components of navigating this transit successfully. For Libra individuals, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius carries significant implications, particularly concerning their personal growth, professional endeavors, and relationships. 
with Mercury governing their 12th house of loss and expenses, as well as their 9th house of fortune, luck, and long-distance travel. Its journey through Aquarius in the 5th house of love, children, and speculation signifies potential success across various aspects of life. During this transit, Libras are prompted to focus on self-improvement and education. There's a shift towards investing time and effort into academic pursuits or developing creative skills, hobbies, and talents. This period fosters a conducive environment for intellectual growth and creative exploration. Since Mercury is in its own ninth house away from Gemini, Libra individuals may be drawn to future-oriented learning and exploration during this transit. They may seek out opportunities for intellectual growth, such as educating themselves, travel, or philosophies, that expand their understanding of the world and their place in it. This period encourages them to broaden their horizons and embrace new experiences that enrich their lives. With Mercury, the ruler of the 12th house, house of spirituality and subconscious mind, transiting the 6th away from 12th house Virgo, Libra individuals may engage in spiritual reflection and healing practices during this transit. They may explore meditation, mindfulness, or leisure activities that promote their happiness and emotional well-being. This period encourages them to release old patterns or burdens that no longer serve them, allowing for greater clarity and personal growth. Libra individuals may excel in analytical problem-solving within their creative projects or ventures during this transit. They may approach challenges with a logical and systematic mindset, finding practical solutions that enhance the quality of their work. Professionally, Libras can anticipate positive outcomes, with indications of increased income and status. Success in endeavors garners recognition from superiors and colleagues, elevating their professional standing. The transit augurs well for career advancement and financial gains, reinforcing a sense of accomplishment and fulfillment. On a personal level, Libra individuals can expect harmonious and fulfilling relationships. The transit revitalizes marital bonds, fostering happiness and affection between partners. Additionally, support from paternal figures enhances personal and professional endeavors, adding a layer of guidance and expertise to their journey. For those in long-distance relationships, this period holds promise for building strong commitments that bolster future prospects. The opportunity for meaningful connections and strengthened bonds contributes to overall satisfaction and fulfillment in relationships. Students, in particular, stand to benefit from opportunities that positively impact their educational goals. The conducive environment facilitates success in academic pursuits while maintaining a balanced outlook on life, fostering a sense of peace and harmony. In summary, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius offers Libra individuals a period of growth, success, and fulfillment across various spheres of life. By embracing opportunities for self-improvement, navigating professional endeavors with determination, and nurturing harmonious relationships, they can navigate this period with confidence and optimism. The alignment of planets sets the stage for personal and professional advancement, reinforcing a sense of balance and fulfillment in their lives. For Scorpio individuals, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius carries significant implications, particularly regarding their home life, professional endeavors, and relationships. With Mercury governing their 8th house of obstacles and inheritance, as well as their 11th house of gains and fulfillment of desires, its journey through Aquarius in the 4th house of domestic stability and peace suggests a period characterized by general happiness and prosperity. Since Mercury is in its own ninth house away from Gemini, Scorpio individuals may envision a future-oriented approach to their home and family life during this transit. They may explore innovative ideas or long-term plans for their living environment, such as renovations, relocations, or family investments. This period encourages them to create a nurturing and supportive home environment that aligns with their vision for the future. In Aquarius, placed in its own sixth house away from Virgo, Scorpios may find themselves focusing on how they can serve their family members or address any health or routine-related issues within the household. They might adopt a pragmatic and adaptable approach to managing daily chores and responsibilities. This transit encourages them to pay attention to the finer details of their daily routines and to make necessary adjustments for greater efficiency. There could be an emphasis on communication within the family regarding health matters or day-to-day -day tasks. Paying attention to the health and well-being of family members, particularly mothers, is emphasized during this transit, highlighting the importance of providing necessary support and medical care as needed. Scorpios may find satisfaction in being of service to their loved ones and may seek out practical solutions to any challenges that arise. During this transit, Scorpios are inclined towards communication within the home environment, particularly with their maternal figures. There's a desire to foster connections and exchange information within the familial sphere, 
with potential interests in real estate matters. Overall, the focus is on nurturing relationships and sharing information within the confines of the home. Professionally, Scorpio individuals may experience mixed outcomes, with opportunities for success in their current field of employment or potential changes, particularly in government sectors. Financial stability can be enhanced through property investments, although caution is advised in legal matters, emphasizing the importance of professional review before committing to any agreements. In relationships, Scorpios prioritize the well-being and contentment of their close connections, valuing intimacy and privacy within partnerships. Caution is exercised in navigating intimate relationships, ensuring mutual respect and understanding. In summary, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius offers Scorpio individuals a period of introspection, nurturing familial bonds, and navigating professional opportunities. By prioritizing communication within the home, exercising caution in professional and financial matters, and nurturing intimate relationships, they can navigate this period with resilience and foresight. The focus on domestic stability and familial well-being underscores the importance of nurturing close connections and providing support to loved ones, contributing to overall happiness and prosperity. For Sagittarius, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius holds significant implications, particularly concerning their personal and professional spheres. With Mercury governing their 7th house of marriage and partnership, as well as their 10th house of career and profession, its journey through Aquarius in the 3rd house of courage, initiative, communication, and short journey suggests a period of potential benefits, albeit with a need for caution in communication. During this transit, Sagittarians are inclined towards communication, counseling, teaching, and travel. There's a propensity towards verbosity, with a desire to gather information and disseminate it widely. This period fosters creativity and innovation, potentially leading to the conception of new business ideas or endeavors in mentoring and guiding others. As the seventh lord, Mercury's transit through the third house in Aquarius can bring intellectual stimulation to your relationships. You may enjoy sharing ideas, discussing shared interests, or engaging in collaborative projects with your partner. This transit may encourage open-mindedness, curiosity, and a willingness to explore new perspectives within your relationship dynamics. As the Tenth Lord transiting the Third House, this period encourages Sagittarius individuals to embrace intellectual curiosity, leading to personal growth and enrichment. Sagittarius individuals may find fulfillment in taking on roles that involve problem-solving, organization, or assisting others in practical ways. This period encourages them to use their skills and expertise to make a positive impact in their workplace or community, contributing to the greater good while also advancing their own professional goals. Mercury's transit through the third house in Aquarius encourages analytical thinking and innovation in your work methods and procedures. You may find yourself scrutinizing the efficiency of your daily routines, seeking ways to improve productivity, or introducing new technologies or approaches to streamline tasks. This transit can help you address conflicts or challenges in your work environment by finding practical solutions. It's essential to maintain clear and open communication to address these conflicts effectively. Professionally, Sagittarians can expect positive outcomes and fresh opportunities arising from their clarity of thought and insightful suggestions. Efforts are likely to be rewarded with recognition and appreciation from superiors, possibly resulting in salary increments or promotions. Travel arrangements related to professional endeavors not only contribute to financial gains but also afford opportunities for quality time with loved ones. Interpersonal relationships require vigilance, care, and affection during this transit. Expressing love and affection verbally helps bridge communication gaps and strengthens connections with loved ones. Clear and concise communication is essential to avoid misunderstandings that could potentially jeopardize both personal and professional relationships. In summary, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius presents Sagittarius individuals with a blend of opportunities and challenges in their personal and professional lives. By embracing their communicative strengths, fostering clarity in thought, and nurturing relationships with care and affection, they can navigate this period with confidence and resilience. The emphasis on effective communication underscores the importance of clarity and understanding in both personal interactions and professional endeavors, ultimately contributing to overall success and fulfillment. For Capricorn, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius holds significant implications, particularly in their family and financial matters. With Mercury governing their sixth house of debt, disease, and rivals, as well as their ninth house of luck, fortune, and long travel, its journey through the second house of family and finances indicates a significant impact on their lives. 
During this transit, Capricorns are characterized by curiosity and a calculated approach towards wealth management. There's a strong focus on assessing resources and seeking avenues to increase wealth to better support their families. This period may see individuals adopting frugal tendencies and paying close attention to their family's financial well-being. As the ninth lord transiting sixth away from its own sign, they may face some conflicts and issues regarding long-distance travel, spiritual and religious beliefs, etc. During this transit, conflicts may arise concerning your personal beliefs or values. You may need to navigate differences in opinion or resolve disputes over moral or ethical issues. It's essential to engage in open and respectful dialogue to address conflicts related to personal values effectively. There may be some delays and obstacles of planning for long-distance travel. When the 6th house Lord Mercury transits 9 houses away to the 2nd house in Aquarius, this transit may prompt you to focus on financial planning and management, particularly in relation to your work or daily routines. This period may encourage you to analyze your work-related finances, such as income, expenses, and benefits. You may need to assess the financial implications of your job or explore opportunities to improve your financial situation through work-related endeavors. You may engage in discussions or analyses to assess your financial situation, create budgets, or develop strategies for saving and investing. Professionally, Capricorns stand to benefit from their persuasive abilities and astute marketing judgment. Business ventures are likely to yield profits, contributing to increased income and the advancement of career endeavors. For those employed, relocation or job changes may be viable options, presenting opportunities for professional growth and development. Financial investments, regardless of the industry, have the potential to be profitable with dedication and persistence. Capricorns are urged to seize opportunities and exercise prudence in financial decisions to maximize returns. On a personal level, relationships with partners are characterized by strength, love, and understanding. However, interactions with other family members, particularly parents, may lack warmth or forward thinking. Clear and honest communication is essential to maintaining healthy relationships while avoiding ambiguity in speech ensures mutual understanding and harmony. Capricorns may find fortune through extended family connections, highlighting the potential benefits of maintaining strong familial ties. Additionally, students are poised to experience positive academic trends, with success anticipated through high scores, particularly in competitive exams. In summary, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius offers Capricorn individuals opportunities for financial stability, professional advancement, and personal growth. By leveraging their strategic abilities, nurturing familial relationships, and pursuing academic excellence, they can navigate this period with confidence and optimism. For Aquarius, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius carries profound implications for Aquarius individuals, particularly impacting their self-awareness, professional endeavors, and personal relationships. With Mercury governing their fifth house of love, children, speculation, and creativity, as well as their eighth house of obstacles and inheritance, its transit through their ascendant or first house of self and personality signifies a period of clarity and discernment. During this transit, individuals born under the sign of Aquarius are characterized by a heightened sense of self-awareness and introspection. There's a curiosity about their life path and progress, prompting a focus on self-education and personal development. Information gathering is directed towards areas of interest, with a propensity to share newfound insights with others. With Mercury, the ruler of the fifth house, house of creativity and self-expression, transiting their first house, house of self, Aquarius individuals may experience a heightened focus on self-expression and creative pursuits during this transit. They may feel inspired to express their unique ideas and perspectives through various forms of art, communication, or self-expression. This period encourages them to embrace their individuality and share their creativity with the world. Since Mercury is in its own ninth house from its Gemini sign, Aquarius individuals may be inclined towards future-oriented personal development and growth during this transit. They may explore new opportunities that expand their understanding of the world and their place in it. This period encourages them to think outside the box and pursue innovative approaches to self-improvement. When the 8th house Lord Mercury transits six houses away to the first house, there may be opportunities for personal transformation and growth. You may encounter conflicts or challenges that push you out of your comfort zone and lead to greater self-awareness and empowerment. This transit encourages you to embrace change and opportunities for personal development and renewal. Professionally, Aquarians stand to benefit from this transit, as it endows them with clarity of thought and the ability to make wise decisions. For self-employed individuals, this period presents opportunities for exploring new ideas, 
albeit with a need for careful implementation. Employed Aquarians are urged to demonstrate diligence and hard work, earning commendation and respect from superiors for their accomplishments. On the personal front, relationships are characterized by happiness, harmony, and mutual understanding. Love relationships thrive, while children bring moments of pride through academic success and rapid advancement. Effective communication fosters closeness and cohesion within the family unit. However, caution is advised in financial matters during this transit, as investments may not yield fruitful outcomes. It's essential for Aquarians to exercise prudence and restraint in monetary decisions to avoid potential setbacks. In summary, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius presents individuals born under this sign with opportunities for self-discovery, professional growth, and harmonious relationships. By embracing their innate curiosity, making wise decisions, and nurturing personal connections, they can navigate this period with clarity and confidence. The emphasis on self-awareness and discernment underscores the importance of introspection and thoughtful decision-making in both personal and professional realms, ensuring a balanced and fulfilling journey forward. For Pisces, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius carries significant implications, particularly impacting their domestic life, professional endeavors, and personal relationships. With Mercury governing their fourth house of domestic peace and prosperity, as well as their seventh house of marriage and partnership, its transit through the twelfth house of long journeys, loss, and expenditure signifies a period of spiritual exploration and potential foreign travel. During this transit, Pisces individuals are drawn towards spiritual pursuits and journeys, with a focus on collecting spiritual knowledge or embarking on pilgrimages. Foreign travel may also be on the horizon, fostering communication and interaction with individuals from different cultures and lands. When the seventh house Lord Mercury transits six houses away to the twelfth house in Aquarius, the twelfth house governs hidden matters, subconscious patterns, and solitude. With Mercury transiting here, conflicts in your relationships may arise due to hidden issues, unspoken tensions, or subconscious patterns. There may be challenges in communication or understanding between you and your partner, leading to feelings of isolation or emotional withdrawal. Pisces individuals are encouraged to prioritize quality time with their partners amidst demanding work schedules. Intimacy and bonding may be affected by professional commitments, highlighting the importance of nurturing personal relationships. The twelfth house also represents isolation and confinement, while Mercury represents communication. This transit may indicate challenges in communication within your relationships, such as difficulties expressing your thoughts and feelings or misunderstandings with your partner. It's essential to be patient and compassionate in your communication, seeking clarity and understanding amidst potential confusion or miscommunication. As the fourth lord transits nine houses away to the twelfth house in Aquarius suggests, you may feel drawn to spend time in the home or personal space or engage in activities that bring you inner peace. There may be a need to nurture your inner sanctuary and create a sense of emotional security within yourself. This transit encourages you to find solace in solitude, meditation, or creative expression as a means of replenishing your emotional reserves and finding inner peace. Communication with family members may potentially be more subtle or intuitive. Professionally, Pisces individuals can anticipate positive outcomes, particularly if engaged in independent entrepreneurship with international business contacts. Expansion and development are on the cards, with potential pay raises and recognition from superiors for accomplishments in the workplace. Financially, caution is advised during this transit, with a need to monitor spending and exercise prudence in investments. It's essential to approach financial decisions with care to mitigate potential losses. Long travels, whether for personal or professional reasons, are beneficial for Pisces individuals, particularly in strengthening their relationship with their partners. Consolidating bonds through shared experiences fosters closeness and intimacy, contributing to overall relationship satisfaction. In summary, the transit of Mercury in Aquarius offers Pisces individuals opportunities for spiritual growth, professional advancement, and personal bonding. By embracing spiritual exploration, exercising financial prudence, and prioritizing quality time with partners, they can navigate this period with balance and fulfillment. As we wrap up this transit episode, remember that these insights are based on sidereal or Vedic astrology which accounts for the approximately 24-degree difference with the tropical zodiac. If you'd like more personalized predictions for their specific zodiac sign or have any questions about their astrological chart, feel free to reach out to us. Stay tuned for more astrological updates. If they found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more astrology insights.
and don't forget to hit the notification bell so they never miss an update. Thank they once again for joining us, and we eagerly anticipate sharing more astrological wisdom with they in the future. Until then, keep exploring, keep learning, and keep shining bright.